cheating the brain. Optical illusion of an expanding black hole. An optical illusion described in the journal, Frontiers in Human Neuroscience makes the observer feel as if he or she were being swallowed by a black hole at the center of a still image. The viewer has the impression of an expanding dark area, as if he were moving towards it. The illusion developed by Norwegian researchers deceives our brains so well that it can even cause the pupils to dilate. However, not everyone is able to see the widening hole. Scientists don't know why this happens. Various forms of optical illusions are widely known. In all of them, we see something that doesn't actually exist, doesn't exist, or simply can't happen. The appropriate arrangement of objects shapes and colors on a plane has an appropriate impact on how information about what we see is processed by our brain. One of the more interesting such illusions is one in which we see a dark area constantly expanding, as if a black hole was consuming us. The description and results of the research were published in the journal, Frontiers in Human Neuroscience, for this illusion, there is a black ellipse in the center of the rectangle. What is important here is the fact that it is surrounded by a shaded, dark area, something like a, halo. The background is white, but in various places, at equal distances from each other vertically, horizontally and diagonally, there are much smaller black ellipses. These no longer have this additional, halo, effect. People looking at such a picture usually focus on the ellipse in the center. The moment we start looking at it, the image we see begins to, move. As a result, we begin to have the impression that this black ellipse begins to enlarge, gradually absorbing the space surrounding it, which, of course, is an illusion. However, an interesting fact is that not everyone notices the expanding black hole. For example, a study conducted in a group of 50 people showed that only or as much as 86% it had the impression of an expanding black space. According to researchers, the expanding hole is a kind of dynamic illusion. In the case of this particular illusion, it tricks our brain into thinking that we notice changes in the brightness of the ellipse's surroundings which of course does not happen in reality. This gives us the impression of, for example, entering deeper and deeper into a dark tunnel. Specifying this and further explaining the mechanism of this illusion, researchers add that it uses the natural reaction of our brain which simply tries to predict potential changes in the brightness level. We can explain this by the reaction of our body when, for example, we enter a dark cave. Even before we enter it for good, our brain prepares us for it by dilating our pupils appropriately, because it anticipates a reduced amount of light in the new environment. The researchers examined the same reaction in the context of the expanding hole illusion. They used special cameras to observe the reaction of the subject's pupils. It was observed that when staring at the black ellipse, they reacted in exactly the same way as if their owners were entering the cave. Interestingly, 
the pupils of people who saw a larger, black hole, dilated even more. An interesting conclusion from these facts is that our pupils react to how we perceive brightness, even imaginary brightness. The study in question was also carried out in a version in which, for example, the color of the ellipse was changed. In this case, the reaction of the subject's pupils was weaker than before. Even more interesting results were obtained by inverting the colors. When the people taking part in the study stared at the white ellipse with a halo, their pupils did exactly the opposite. They began to constrict. However, it is still unclear why some people seem not to be susceptible to this type of delusion at all. The existence of a hidden corridor in the Great Pyramid of Giza has been confirmed. The pyramids still hide secrets from us. A group of researchers using the muon tomography technique discovered the presence of a previously unknown corridor inside the Great Pyramid of Giza. The corridor is 9 meters long and 2 meters wide and is located above the main entrance to the pyramid. Egyptian authorities have reported the existence of a hidden corridor above the main entrance to the Great Pyramid of Giza. Video from an endoscopic camera showed the interior of the corridor which is 9 meters long and 2.1 meters wide. The first reports about possible, empty spaces, inside the Great Pyramid appeared in 2016 and 2017. This was announced by scientists associated with the SCAN Pyramids project which began in 2015 as a collaboration between major universities in France, Germany, Canada and Japan and a group of Egyptian experts. Research using scanning muon streams had already led to serious suspicions that there was a previously unknown chamber or corridor above the original main entrance on the northern wall. Now scientists from the Technical University of Munich, TUM, have used ultrasound and endoscopy to confirm previous suspicions. The Great Pyramid, also known as the Pyramid of Cheops or the Pyramid of Khufu, is located on the Giza Plateau. It is the largest pyramid built by the ancient Egyptians. It was established during the Old Kingdom around 2560 BC. Egyptologists assume that the monument's construction time was 20 years, and its purpose was the tomb of Pharaoh Cheops, Chu Fu. The pyramid is nearly 140 meters high originally 146.59 meters and 230 meters wide. It consists of approximately 2.3 million stone blocks. Despite being one of the oldest and largest structures on Earth, there is no consensus among researchers as to how it was built. To better understand its internal structure, scientists from the Scan Pyramids project scanned the pyramid using muons, unstable elementary particles belonging to the lepton category, 
which are only partially absorbed by the stone. Muons are related to electrons. They have the same properties, but over 200 times more mass. They are created when high-energy particles called cosmic rays collide with the nuclei of gas atoms in the Earth's atmosphere. This is the so-called secondary cosmic radiation. Muons are created from these collisions. Their most interesting feature is that they can penetrate matter to some extent. The researchers decided to use this technique because it does not destroy the tested object. Traveling at a speed close to the speed of light, muons bombard the Earth from all sides. Each palm-sized area of our planet is hit by approximately one muon per second. These particles can penetrate hundreds of meters of solid material before being absorbed. The chamber or corridor found by researchers is larger than expected. Through a hole found between the stones, scientists introduced an endoscopic camera into the empty space previously located using muon tomography confirming the existence of a previously unknown room. Discovering an empty space in the pyramid is already something special. But the fact that this chamber is large enough to accommodate several people makes this discovery even more important, says Professor Christian Gross from TUM. The first measurement data indicated the existence of a corridor at least 5 meters long. But according to preliminary estimates made after endoscopic examination, the length of the chamber reaches 9 meters. Scientists did not see any traces of human activity in the chamber. So they assume that no one has seen this room for about 4,500 years. Determining the purpose of the newly discovered chamber and what is behind its back wall will require additional research. Some believe that this room played an architectural role and helped ensure structural integrity. However, confirmation of the existence of a previously unknown room highlights the need for further research into the Egyptian pyramids. In 2017, in the Pyramid of Cheops, after scanning with muons, an empty space about 30 meters long was discovered, which is located just above the so-called The Great Gallery.